Hello guys again and welcome back to another unboxing, viewing and testing and today we've got this huge massive router from Xiaomi this is the MI Lot router AX3600 and we can see we've got a Wi-Fi 6 is the latest generation in a Wi-Fi standards compared to the previous generation of Wi-Fi 5 in a terms of transfer rates coverage and data latency, it has been vastly improved all that, especially when multiple devices are connected at the same time. Wi-Fi 6 router are significantly reduced and lower end device latency and unresponsiveness. A lot one click to start smart life. Quickly discover a Xiaomi smart device by entering into the network. Open the MI Home app to discover utilized MI smart devices. Connect to the network and access a wide range of smart future with a touch of a button. Qualcomm 6 core processor, stable internet connection for multitasking easier to use. The Qualcomm 6 core enterprise class professional chip for more stable operation. The IPQ80 71A Enterprise Glass Professional Chips powered by the Qualcomm Quad-Core 64-bit A53 CPU dual-core network acceleration engine offers a much better DMIPS capability than other router manufacturers speed specification chip solution for more processing power and more stable operation. You know, more CPU, better results. Dedicated A-Load antenna with a one-click network connection for smart devices. Wi-Fi speed up to 2,976 megabits per second offers two bands of 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz each with the AEX technology and no mutual interference. The two bands offer a combined dual band wireless speed up to 2976 megabits. The 2.4 GHz frequency band features longer transmission for a better coverage and better wall penetration performance. And the 5G frequency band of course provides low interference and high speed for smoother HD 4K video, playback, gaming, transfer files, download, and you will have the smoother experience to do all this application. 248 supports 248 devices, stable connection, CPU utilization less than 20%, and with the 512 megabyte memory, you can have the 248 devices connected all together with no problem and working smoothly. External high performance signal amplifier better coverage with no need for wall penetration. With these six antennas you will have a large coverage at your home, at your store, at your place you are going to install this massive router and with no problem you will have the best signal. Now let's check from the other side, we can see fully upgrade Wi-Fi 6 router, Xiaomi devices that you can connect very easy with the A-Load antenna, one click to start smart life, plentiful software of features, parental control, device speed control, guest Wi-Fi, easy setup and management, full gigabyte ports, dedicated 583 megabits A-Load antenna for smart devices, and of course the Qualcomm 6 core processor with a large 512 megabyte RAM, and 256 megabyte of ROM. Oh, nice all that. Let's open it to see what we have inside. Ooh, voila. Whoa, this is a huge router. A huge, massive router. We have a foam protection around the box. Very nice to protect the precious and huge router. Now, inside at the box, we can see we've got an Ethernet cable. Not too long, it's about 50 centimeters. CAT5E UTP The adapter of course and we've got uh, 12 volt 2 amps 24 watt Nice It's about 1 meter the cable Connection Ooh, and a huge massive router Lift up Okay And inside of course we've got and the manual if you want to read it, it's your choice, but stay with me, you're going to find out all about this product. Okay, let's lift up the antennas. Seven antennas. And let's take out the protection for the antennas. And reveal this huge router. 
MIL Load Router AX3600. You can see here the logo. I like the finish here, this uh, bronze. We've got two LEDs, system and internet LED here. I will plug it in to see. We've got the high heat dissipation for stable operation, large aluminum audio heat sink and high thermal conductive adhesive are used to cool the router with a cooling vents on the top, bottom side of the body. We can see in here, we've got some rubber for rubber. It will stay, not going to move anywhere. It will be very stable and that's how it will have a gap from the ventilation holes to your table to ventilate and cool down your router. Remember, it is a six core router. And we can see this is a metal piece is installed on the top of the triangular safety body to accelerate the heat transfer from the inside to outside, providing stable thermal support for high speed router operation. From the back, we have the reset button the power input, three Ethernet ports and one one. You can connect your modem router here. This is the way that I'm going to work uh, this router. From my modem I will connect my VDSL to this uh, router and then all the devices, 45 Wi-Fi devices, they will be connected to this massive huge router. And we will do some tests, testing my internet speed from my laptop, PC, smartphone. I will copy some files to my server, download some files from the internet, and we'll check out all the speed and the, all the process, how it works, this uh, router. And of course, we've got an LEDs to the Ethernet port. Now, of course, I need to find out the right place to put this router. It is a huge router, <laughs> the diameter. It is 41 centimeters, 13.4 centimeters, and 17.7 centimeters. It is huge. And 70 centimeters is the antenna. Seven antennas, high antennas. I hope they will do the job to have a good results about my internet speed and the coverage to my home. Now let's plug it in. And we can see we've got an orange light. This is the system. I will do the connection with the cable. Now we can see we've got a blue light, the antenna is blue, I like this, <laughs> very nice. It gives another future to the old router. Internet is orange LNG, it will go to blue when internet is available. And now I think it's time to set up this router. When you're going to connect your PC or laptop through the Ethernet cable to your router and open your browser, it will pop up this menu. Select your county or region of use. I have read an agreement, okay. Try now. Select your country. Next. Try it now. Next. Now this is the Wi-Fi name, Wi-Fi password. Put the Wi-Fi password that you want. Make a Wi-Fi password or other administrator password. For a better experience, automatically upgrade the firmware. Now enable 160 MHz dynamic bandwidth to a high throughput and better coverage. Okay, next. It is recommended to save a screen of your Wi-Fi password below. Okay, I remember, no problem. Set up complete Wi-Fi restarting according to national laws and regulations, etc., etc. The 5G Wi-Fi uses 160 MHz bandwidth. It is necessary to do back-off radar signal detection. 5G Wi-Fi signal can only be turned on after 60 seconds. Please wait. Okay, let's wait. Now, you need to go to this address, enter the admin password, or you can download the MI Wi-Fi app to manage your router. But First, I will show you how to do it from your laptop or your PC. And there we are. Status, settings, smart connect. When the future is on, 2.4 and 5G network will share a name, one name. The router will choose the best available signal. For example, it will switch to 5G network 
if this device is closed, and to 2.4G network if it is far away. Brief interruption may occur during the switch. Well, I will leave it off. I would like to see both of the networks, N2.4 and 5G. If you turn it on, you will see only one network. From here, you can turn on off your network. The name, you can choose the name of your network, hide the network, send save. Encryption, choose the encryption. This is, I think it's okay. The password, you can see the password, change the password. Wireless channel, let's leave it auto to six. Bandwidth, 40, 20, 20, and 40 megahertz. And signal strength, let's leave it to high. To 5G, again, the name, encryption, the password, We've got the wireless channel, it goes auto 48, and you can choose from 36 to 112. And the bandwidth, 160, 80, 40, 20. And you can choose 20, 40, or 80. And Wi-Fi 5, compatible mode. Some older devices do not support Wi-Fi 6 well and may have compatibility issues such as scan failure or Wi-Fi connection failure. After this switch is turned on, the router will run in Wi-Fi 5 compatible mode to resolve the compatibility issues. It will also turn off Wi-Fi 6 related functions such as off DMA, BSS coloring ATC. In compliance with national laws and regulations, the router is performing radar single detection and avoidance. The Wi-Fi connection will be turned on in 58 seconds. Please wait. Well, let's wait. Well, if you've got any issues with this uh, compatible mode, that just turn it off. Mumimu on, that's night. Need terminal support to enhance Wi-Fi experience. A lot intelligent and then automatic scan. Let's leave it on. Now let's go to network settings. Connection type DHCP, IP address, subnet mask, default getaway, DNS. DHCP internet connection type, DNS automatically and manual, TPPOE and static IP. For now, let's leave it here. Apply, cancel. One port speed, auto recommended speed. We've got 1000 megabits and 100 megabits. Let's leave it on auto. Card mark address. Switch between router mode and repeater mode. Countries region must be set identically to connect a new router to a my router in repeater mode. Nice, you can switch. Select mode. Primary base station set up a Wi-Fi network. Wireless repeater mode. Extend existing network and wired network repeater extend existing network. Well, I will choose a wired network repeater because I'm taking from my modem through the Ethernet connected to my MI Lot Xiaomi router. Next. If you have turned on guest Wi-Fi, the guest Wi-Fi will turn it off after switching to wired amplifier mode. Okay. Connect MI router one port to existing router. Okay. Make sure my router and existing router are connected to the same network. Some future and plugs may be blocked in repeater mode. Router setup is wired repeater, network Xiaomi we can see here, router IP, this is your attention, some future and plugs in may be blocked, okay, copy this, and again you need to put the new address that I already copy, and enter the admin password. And here we are, now it's working as a repeater, main modem router takes wired the internet, to the Xiaomi and then Xiaomi with the 2.4 gigahertz and the 5 gigahertz it gives wireless the internet to the devices. 2.4G uh, we can see I've got 28 devices and to 5G only two devices of course that is changing as the day is passing more devices are connected or disconnected it depends who and when uh, the device is connected and here you can see the password with this I click it set and again, it is the same uh, settings as I saw you in the first time. You can see all the settings here on the Wi-Fi is not changing anything. It will be better to leave it on off that. Uh, some smartphone, they will get the Wi-Fi 6 reception if that is off. I have tried with uh, two smartphones and when it is on, I didn't see any Wi-Fi 6. That's how leave it off. 
Okay. Network settings. Here you can switch from a wired network repeater to a primary base and next. Security, change administration password, status. And here we've got to check for updates, factory data reset, system language, region, the same thing. When you are working as a repeater uh, mode, you will have uh, less settings. Well, guys, uh, that was end the setup for this MI Lot router AEX 3600 by Xiaomi setup. It was uh, very easy uh, from my PC or laptop uh, through the Ethernet cable. Next time in my next video, I will do it. And from the MI Wi-Fi app, we will see the settings, the features that it has the app and how it can help us uh, to manage uh, the router. First look, I can say is very promising. I like the design, the way that it looks. It fits very well to my place. I like the antennas, everything. It's uh, very nice. And for the price, it costs only uh, 95 euros. Very good price. Well, to my next video, I will do a test internet speed, Wi-Fi speed. I will copy some files to my server, download some files from the internet, from my laptop, PC, smartphone, 5 meters away, 15 meters away from the Xiaomi router. And that's how we are going to find out uh, the coverage, the speed that it has to my place. Until then, guys, stay tuned, hit the notification bell, pre-subscribe to my YouTube channel, like what's like my videos your choice but sir this video you never know who may need it stay tuned and you will see in the next video testing this router have a nice and lovely day bye bye